The Jack and Cheryl Morris Cancer Center is really the embodiment of the future of the care delivery system for cancer patients. The physical architecture of the building has a direct effect on the well-being of a patient. We've looked at how light can enter the building, whether it's in the patient rooms, the treatment areas, light can enter those spaces to provide a healing environment. It's important to be wrapping a blanket around the cancer patient and taking some of that burden off of their shoulders from the moment they engage with us. When I care for people, I'm looking at them potentially as though they're my mother or my father. There is really nothing like this in the state of New Jersey. We've been able to build that because of the fact that we had a comprehensive cancer center, a major teaching hospital, and a medical school right here. Through the generosity of Jack and Cheryl Morris, that really provides an opportunity for us to accommodate the volume that we have to improve patient throughput. We have an ability to come in here and actually design care. We want to make sure that the technologies that we're offering are as easy and as straightforward for our patients to utilize, that our patients can see their lab results, their clinical results in their hands as quickly as possible. We have access to the incredible resources and expertise that resides just across the sky bridge. Our staff will be able to utilize the latest and the greatest in radiation therapy technology. From a radiation therapist standpoint, that's career fulfillment. Even if well-established curative standards exist, there's some element of research that is important to that care. Those advancements and that research and the results of all that work from the bench to the bedside, you naturally elevate the level of care. It has been a terrific experience to be able to provide our input. It was great to see those nurses engaged and really participate in the design. The pediatric unit is going to be transformational for the children. So they're not thinking about, I'm here for my cancer treatment. Having the mission so clearly defined in the Morris is something that is really inspiring to be working on the project for. Our DEVCO partners were there from the beginning. I'm particularly proud of efforts between the Rutgers Cancer Institute, RWJ Barnabas Health, the state of New Jersey and Middlesex County. Everyone is truly involved in the design of the space and making sure that it's the most efficient and highest quality of care to our patients. The Morris Cancer Center is going to provide opportunities for our staff to be able to experience bench to bedside under one roof. On average, nurses walk two to three miles a day treating patients. Whatever we can do to reduce that walking means that that nurse can spend more time providing direct care to the patient. All our staff will be our primary focus to make sure that they're getting the right tools for the right moment. We know cancer is complex. It's complex scientifically, and of course, emotionally and socially. And you need a well-rounded team to be able to address the complexity of cancer care. We want to offer the building to our employees, just like we're offering it to the patients and their families. We have to care for ourselves in order to do this work. We have many positions available in all of the services from bone marrow to surgical oncology to med surge. Being able to expand our services to patients is extremely rewarding. It makes us think a little bit about our practice principles around how we want to provide care for patients. You're going to be joining a tremendous team that's fully integrated and dedicated to teamwork and collaboration.